of the night beer till Christmas my true love gave to me. Brash Brewing Co. Uh, Blue Collar Beer Review, your old buddy Jimbo, back at it again. One beer, one take. All for y'all. All for y'all. So, we're heading down the road to the Christmas extravaganza. You know, all that good stuff. So, I got a little something that's not Christmassy, but it has to do with the year. And, and well, it says it does, so <laughs> I thought it was kind of... I thought it was kind of brash of them. So this beer, this beer is from Brash Brewing Company. They're out of H-Town, Texas. Oh yeah. One of my favorite places in the world. Yeah. All right. And this is Urban Achiever. Brash. All right. It's a bourbon barrel aged white Russian milk stout. Oh, a little right white Russian. You know who loves white Russians, don't you? And not just old Jimbo, but the dude. Yeah, the dude. You either know or you know, or you don't know what I'm talking about. But the dude, he loves some uh, white Russians. So there you go. Hopefully this has some of that... Um, White, white Russian-ness to it, all right? And I'm expecting this to be Brash, <laughs> Brash Brewing. Their name is for real. These guys don't play around. <laughs> I, 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 you know, I've heard some things about them and uh, the owner and stuff like that. And uh, it's, it's kind of funny. And this beer is exceptionally funny. And I'm gonna show you why it's funny in a minute. All right, so stand by for that segue into funning, funniness, awesome, you know, just some, just some D-bag move, <laughs> but I love it. So this is a baby beer, it's a baby can, baby can, baby can, but a good friend of mine gave me this. Uh, actually gave me a couple of them, but I haven't tried them. I haven't tried them. This is gonna be this is gonna be the first one, and then I'm gonna have another one for later, if I love this, which I think I'm gonna really like this. All right, because it's a stout, and it's a white Russian milk stout, and that sounds wonderful, wonderful. Okay, so it's probably gonna be creamy and dare I say, orgasmic. I I think it could be. Okay, so. Back at it, to the nuts and bolts of it. <laughs> 12 fluid ounces, and this beer is 9% alcohol by volume. ABV, Will, ABV, ABV, Will. All right? So, now, I told you these guys are, they're Brash Brewing Company. They're, they're Brash. And they, they, uh, they don't care. They don't care. They're going to make beer the way they want to make beer. And we've, I, I've reviewed a, f a couple of their beers before, and they're usually pretty crazy, and they're usually damn good. So I told you I was going to review beers that I think are companies that I know make good beers on these 12 days till Christmas or 12 beers till Christmas. I, I, I mess up my own thing. Yeah, 12 beers to Christmas. We're on number nine and we're doing a brash. So here we go. I'm gonna crack it open, do the double dump. I'm gonna do the look, listen, and smell. I'm gonna show you something. I think you might get a kick out of it. I, I, I know I am going to. So here we go. Bang. Well, then it's stout, you know? It's a stout, they're, they're thick. They're creamy, but they're not gonna be active. So let's dump her in and see what happens. Oh, Texas tea, black, 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 way black. Texas tea, motor oil. Ooh, look at that surf. Oh, 
Look at that. It has a little, it's got some life to it. Look at that's impressive. All right, see, brash. They're not playing. They, they threw me a loop already. Usually you can dump these crazy and they're not even going to do anything. But look at that. It's got a good head on it, but it's barely talking to me. These, these stouts are like a whisper. They're like, and I, I just wanted to tell you, which is pretty cool. It's like a whisper and you know, it's super dark and Mm. Oh. It smells so wonderful. The breath of an angel. You know, if the angel drank a bunch of coffee and booze. Which are my kind of favorite. My favorite kind of angels. I don't know. See, Brash, this is a urban achiever, right? And it's the 2020 Kinsucket edition, <laughs> which is pretty cool. They're brash, they don't care. It's what they put on their can. Do you wanna know what's also cool about this can? I don't review labels, I don't. And I don't review bottles or cans or anything. I review beer. This is their beer label that they put on this beer can. <laughs> and you want to know how brash these guys are? They put their beer in someone else's can. Southern Star. Subatomic Brewing Company <laughs> Juicy Indian Parallel. They're like, I don't know. They got someone else's cans. They got someone's cans. They, they I, I don't think they're recycled. I, I, they could be recycled or they could have just stole them for all I know. I like to think they stole them or they got them. You know, they, they, they were like, oh, we don't have enough. We're Southern Star. We don't have enough beer to fill all these cans. So we'll just sell them to someone else. And Brass was like, we'll buy them at a discount and put our delicious beer in them. Because Southern Star, eh, you know, I've, I've reviewed some of their beers and they kind of suck. So, <laughs> I thought that was cool, man. I thought that was really cool. So let's do the double dump and get into this brass because these guys are already impressing me. I'm down with it. Does that look cool? Does it, do, do I look cool? I don't know. I don't care. I, I'd probably look like an idiot, but, you know? So, I was talking about the dude. The dude abides. So, here you go. The dude abides. Mm. Mm. Look at that nonsense. Look at that. Look at that. Are you looking? Oh. Not much. This is not going to give you much burp. <clears throat> but look at the look at the Brussels lace. You can see where I started the pour. I took the first drink, and then boom, 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 gone. This beer is delicious. It it it, it tastes. It's got a little boozy to it, but not, not as much as I thought. It it has the um, it has the Lebowski to it. It has, it has the Lebowski to it. It's got that, uh, yeah, that white Russian kind of taste to it. A little bit of, um, you know, vodka Kahlua type, uh, creamy, um, chocolatey type coffee, a little bit of coffee. It's, it's, it's just a wonderful beer. Um, yeah, wait a minute. Yeah, I, I keep on lifting that can. Let me, let me, let me get back to it. Guy's got a mask on goggles. Brash Brewing. Urban Achiever. Brash. Bourbon barrel aged white Russian milk stout. If you can get it, 
Get it. Drink it. Love it. I'm telling you, this beer is most definitely Jimbo approved. Look it. I love y'all. Let's keep it rolling, man. Leave a message. Leave a like. Uh, tell a friend, man. It's, it's, it's coming fast. It's starting to snowball now. You know, our Christmas adventure, our uh, 12 beers till Christmas. We're almost there. It's going to happen. So make sure you get your shopping done and stuff like that. Your old buddy Jimbo loves you. And your old buddy Jimbo's 